What's up everybody, it's Mark from 403 Fauna. On today's video, we're gonna take a look at clutch number four. Now this is between a hypo clown and a spot nose pastel head clown. So I got my first chance at ever producing some clowns here at 403 Fauna. So I hope you kick back and listen in and enjoy the video. So the mom of this clutch laid only three eggs, but those eggs are huge. Look at these long eggs we got going on here. Now there's a 50% chance I produce clowns in this clutch, but I really want to produce some spot nose clowns. And I honestly don't mind whether there's pastel in it or not. So I believe that's 25% chance to produce spot nose clowns. And with only three eggs, my odds aren't very good for that. But you never know, I might hit a spot nose clown. I might hit three spot nose clowns minus the pastel. I might not hit any clowns at all. And that's the exciting thing about breeding ball pythons is what is in there. So let's take a look. Super excited for this one. So it's actually day 59 now. And these eggs peel off really easily. I could feel that little baby moving in there. Already well dimpled. Should be an easy cut. Are we gonna have our first clown in this egg? And remember, all these will be 100% het hypo as well. So the worst I could get is some double hets here. And we have, oh my gosh, I think we have a clown in here. So we got that side pattern. Yeah, this is a clown right here. Question is whether it's spot nose. Looks like it might be a pastel clown. And I'll be honest, pastel clowns are not the prettiest snakes in the world. But I don't mind because this will be a clown hit hypo right here. So really stoked for that. So we're one for three on the clown so far. Let's see if we can make it two for three. 50% chance at hatching some clowns here. So flip a coin. I flipped the right way on that first one. Let's see if this one will also be a clown. I wouldn't mind spot nose, double hit hypo clowns. That would be really nice as well. At day 59, these babies are pretty much ready to pip. And we have Oh, we have a spot nose, it looks like. So that one doesn't look like a clown, but definitely spot nose. Let me open up a little bit and see if pastel might be a part of this mix. I don't think it's a pastel spot nose, but we got a spot nose. Oh yeah, you know what? That does look pastel right there. So we got a pastel spot nose, double head, hypo clown. Hopefully this is a girl right here. So far we've hit the odds here, 50-50. First one was a clown, second one was not. Let's hope this third one puts the odds in my favor. Come on, regular spot nose clown, hit hypo. That first one looked like it was a pastel. I'm thinking it, it is a pastel spot nose, but it could be just a pastel clown, hit hypo. Didn't get a chance to see the head. Okay. What do you guys think? Clown or not? 
let's find out. Okay, it does not look clown, but it does look spot nose. And it doesn't look like pastels in this one. So I think we got right here a spot nose clown, double head. I'm sorry, spot nose double head hypo clown. I'll take that. So I got my clown. I got my regular spot nose double head. Hopefully it'll be just like my last clutch in which I got all females. But we'll wait for that when they come out and shed. Now I've got another clutch that's ready to go and it's pretty late right now. I think I'll save that for tomorrow. It's a genetic stripe clutch. I might make this a double video, double egg cutting video. But if not, hey, have a great day. Take care and be safe.